Hello everyone, my name is Mario. On this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to crop your assignments using Kami. So whichever document you have, you can actually use this Google Chrome extension uh, to edit any assignments. As a Mac user, we don't have the snipping tool, uh, but this will be another way that you can do it without having the snipping tool as a Mac user. So let's jump right into it. Kami is an application that we can use to edit some of the PDF files. And let me show you how that works. And I think this is really effective. So I discovered this a few days ago and I wanted to share with you. And it's something that's been like uh, very hard for me to do it without this. So now that I know how to use Kami, uh, I'm gonna show you how this is done. If you haven't downloaded the extension for Kami, I highly recommend doing it. Go ahead and just click on that link there. And then um, after you install the extension, then come back to the video. Well, now that you're back to the video, uh, we're going to go ahead and um, edit some of this PDF right here. So this is my homework, uh, my assignment that I'm gonna give to my students. So right here, um, I'm gonna do this homework, but because it's distance learning, I don't wanna give all these problems to my students. So instead of what I'm going to do is I'm gonna give them questions three to nine and 11 through 14 all. So here it is. Uh, you're gonna go to shapes, okay? And make sure that you select the stroke thickness to be fill fill and very important right here this is a big one make sure that this here is all the way up so i think default is like right there if you do that you'll see what happens but make sure that also under here palette and make sure that the color white is selected if you do this fill and like you leave it in default look what happens notice that it didn't go all the way but do Control c to undo so what you want to do um to get the uh, actual um, portion, uh, to get rid of the actual portion, here's what you do. You get the color white, you get this transparency filled up all the way, make sure it's fill here. And now you can go ahead and drag the section that you want to get rid of. So I'm gonna get rid of this portion here. Notice how nice it looks. Hey, look at that, you guys. And that is gone. Now, I also wanna get rid of this even numbers here because that's not part of my assignment. So I'm gonna get rid of that. I already have this tool selected. So let me go ahead and show you this how easy this is you guys look at that okay you just let go and it's gone so i want to get rid of this as well so i'm going to repeat the process one more time if you do want to go back and, and say you want to go back to this uh the original file you just go to eraser okay and you just go right here and now you get it back okay so i'm going to go back here there <laughs> um now i'm going to save this one so i can give this assignment to my students so I'm gonna go right here. You can go to save. You can put it in your uh, Google Drive as well, but I'm just gonna download it. Uh, when you download it, you might wanna make sure that this selection is selected here. Um, PDF with all annotations. Okay, so for that one, and I'm just gonna name it, let's name it Kami Export. Okay, and this is important right here, this portion right here, make sure that you are selecting annotated pages only. Notice that this document is eight pages long but the only one to save the one that is one page. So you just click right here and you wanna begin export. On the bottom left right here, you'll see that the file is being downloaded. This is the file that has been already edited and that you are able to use it with your students. And there it is. <laughs> That's it, you guys. Do you see how simple it was? However, if you still wanna use the snippet tool um, here, you can still do it. Control Shift 4, right? And you can still do it and you have it there. Now you have a PNG and you have a PDF. Now let me make sure how this works good. Okay, there it is. That's my PNG and this is my PDF. Okay, well that is it for this tutorial. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Please give it a, a thumbs up if you enjoy it and don't forget to subscribe. My name is Mario and I will see you on the next video.